Good morning, I'm Ashley Wheeler from Two Works for You, and here are today's top stories. This morning, investigators are searching for a motive after a traffic stop turned into a deadly mass shooting in West Texas. Five people are dead and at least 21 more injured after yesterday's manhunt ended outside a movie theater in Odessa. Police say the gunmen started shooting people at stores and restaurants across several locations in Odessa. The suspect at one point ditching his car for a stolen post office truck. And Hurricane Dorian is moving closer to the Bahamas and has been upgraded to a Category 5. It's bringing heavy rain and 160 mile per hour winds. It is estimated that the Carolinas will get between 5 and 10 inches of rain with isolated cases of 15 inches. A tropical storm warning was issued between Deerfield Beach up to Sebastian Inlet in South Florida. The hurricane is still moving west at 8 miles per hour. And authorities are cracking down on drunk drivers this holiday weekend. We're waiting to hear results from last night's checkpoint that was set up near 15th and Yale. Tulsa Police, the Oklahoma Highway Patrol and Tulsa County Sheriff's Office came together to stop impaired drivers in Midtown. In the last three weeks, OHP has arrested more than 160 impaired drivers. If you plan on celebrating this weekend, make sure you have a designated driver in DUI Oklahoma, also offering $10 discount on Uber until tomorrow. You can get your code at enduiok.com. And we're going to get a check of today's forecast from meteorologist Kerrigan Chauvin. Kerrigan. Well, that cloud cover is going to continue to break up as we go throughout your mid-morning and early afternoon. Temperatures rising into those upper 80s as we go into the 3 o'clock hour, mostly sunny by that time, and back into those middle 80s as we go into this evening. Pretty pleasant temperatures all throughout the day today. Could be really nice to go out for a walk with your furry friend. Forecast highs for this afternoon to our south. We're looking at lower 90s there in McAllister and Poto. Uh, upper 80s here in Tulsa and Okmulgee, Muskogee as well at 87. And over Overall, the next seven days are going to remain pretty quiet. We're looking at lots of sunshine and temperatures staying mild in those upper 80s and lower 90s. Ashley? Thank you so much, Kerrigan. That was our digital update. Keep checking for updates throughout the day. I'm Ashley Wheeler, 2 Works For You.